A new attraction is looking to elevate Sentosa into a top global destination. A nature-inspired trail is opening next Thursday, linking the island's beaches to Resorts World. It's believed to be the first of its kind in Southeast Asia. Along with the flora and fauna, it's also featuring artificial intelligence. Aslam Shah with his sneak peek. Sentosa Sensory Scape is one of a kind in Southeast Asia. The nature-inspired footpath is about the size of five and a half football fields linking Imbia and beach stations. While walking the trail, visitors can also wander off to other locations. This is the first attraction introduced under the Sentosa Brani Master Plan. The tourism development, which was first announced in 2019, will span the next few decades. The trail starting point is here at the Lookout Loop. So architecturally, the Lookout Loop is a spiral walkway which allows our guests to enjoy the panoramic views, especially under this uh, mamba tree and it blossoms like cherry blossom, especially in the month of February and August. These trees are among the flora and fauna introduced to give visitors a biophilic experience where nature nourishes the hearts and minds. Down the pathway, visitors can enter this vessel that focuses on textures. We get inspirations from how a vase contains uh, nature's treasure over here. So the curated uh, landscape here will give a very strong contrast versus the kind of a natural landscape that's outside of these vessels. Okay, BK, some very interesting plants that I'm seeing here. What am I touching right now? Okay, this is a more needle-like, very soft textures plant that we're holding. Versus all this very fine green kind of a tony texture, you also can proceed to the more the needle-like. Yeah, some actually contain more water, and mm. some actually is very hard and, uh, and actually very big leaf, like this uh, foxtail. The space is big enough to host events, wedding photo shoots and more. The next stop is filled with the sounds of nature. Right now it feels like I'm in the middle of a waterfall and these sounds are heightening my sense of hearing. So BK, what is really the inspiration behind this space? Oh, so this is known as a symphonic streams. As the name says, it's, it actually comprises multiple uh, streams of water falling down from all these magnificent, uh, well-designed uh, pole. Uh, so it creates a polyphonic and surrounded sound effect. This uh, vessel, which is closer to the oceans, we call your focus on the oceanic theme. After the sun sets, the experience of the trail hits a new high thanks to the use of technology. This feature helps set it apart from similar attractions in Southeast Asia. It's a whole new experience at night. Now first mooted in 2017, construction began at the end of 2019 and part of the idea is to keep Sentosa at the forefront of tourist attractions in the region. Now this 350 meter passageway comes with multiple features that not only engages the five senses of the visitors, but also their imagination. The trail uses artificial intelligence and various cutting-edge technologies at night. Here, visitors can use their digital devices to let their imaginations run wild. You can see all these uh, creatures, uh, butterflies uh, coming to life at night uh, in this ma very magical moment. They will actually gather around us as we move. We need to do a calibration or recalibrations to make sure all the lights and all the vibrations and all the superimposition and sensors all worked uh, together. How do we approach the entire narration or narrative of our sensory scape? We started off by wanting to also uh, talk about our Singapore spirit. When we want to do something, actually we don't just do what is just necessary. We go beyond to value add, like how Singapore create not just a city, but also for a garden city as a start, that progress to city in a garden and then city in nature. So in the same light and spirit, we created Sensory Scape. The Sentosa Sensory Scape opens daily to the public from 14 March.